Jerry O'Connell, star of The Talk, has admitted that he wasn't pleased that Ryan Seacrest was chosen to host live rather than him. Following Kelly Ripa's departure from her previous co-host, Michael Strahan, in 2016, the actor made multiple guest appearances on the show. Rob Lowe's podcast, Literally, featured Jerry, 49. He was questioned about how he got the job on the talk throughout the program. The Kangaroo Jack actor credited it to his frequent appearances on Live as a stand-in co-host and his close friendship with Kelly Ripa. I was booked on as the third guest on Kelly and Regis. This was 13 to 12 years ago, and they bumped me, he said. They were out of time because the first visitor crossed over. I was furious. I was furious. I was like, f asterisk asterisk, this is asterisk asterisk, and I got back on the tube, he said. I was like, I'm never doing that show again, as soon as I got on the train. F asterisk asterisk, those individuals. Jerry recalled that a week later, he received a call from the live crew requesting him to return to the show. It took him a few minutes to realize that he wasn't simply making an appearance on the show, but also serving as co-host. And then I was standing with Kelly and they said, Live with Kelly and Regis. Jerry revealed on the program. Jerry is covering for Regis today. I'm presenting the show, I exclaimed. Yes, you're hosting, she said. We went out, and since it was my first time, I wasn't sober. The celebrity reported that the concert went well in spite of the challenges he had, and he was asked to fill in over 100 times he calculated. Jerry and Kelly had a great rapport, but despite this, he wasn't given a long-term job on the show. Rather, he was defeated by Ryan, 48, which infuriated him. On the podcast, Jerry stated, I've never been the frontrunner for a job. And after working with Kelly as a co-host for several months, I was not hired. That job went to Ryan Seacrest. He's also incredibly skilled, exceptionally gifted and competent. The reviews were excellent. He was undoubtedly the right decision. I would have been a mistake, he went on. However, following that, I thought, I have to succeed in daytime TV now. Jerry did reconnect with Kelly in 2022, despite not being selected to co-host live. They set aside their rivalry in talk shows to commemorate one of Kelly's greatest successes. Jerry asked Kelly questions regarding the book Live Wire at a Chicago Q&A. On her Instagram, she posted multiple images from the occasion in which she was tagged. She was tagged by HarperCollins in a picture where she was positioned next to Jerry O'Connell and what looked to be some fans. The post was titled, Thanks Ladies, by her. Jerry tagged the actress in another photo that was reposted by holding up a copy of Kelly's book to the camera. Even though his antics occasionally worry viewers, Jerry is nevertheless a beloved character on daytime television. The talk hostess from Scream 2 caused a stir when he tried a terrifying stunt live on television in October. Jerry performed a headstand on his chair while imitating a keg stand during an Amanda Klutz episode. Amanda admitted on the television that she was hoping to go to a frat party. She stated, I have never gone to a frat party. We do need this to happen. It is a bucket list goal of mine. There's a lot of beer and vomit and stuff at a frat party, Jerry joked, telling his co-host that she should aim higher. It's just a life thing that I want to tick off that I never got to tick off, Amanda retorted. The actor said, how about this? Let's make sure that Amanda does a keg stand at some point. The crowd erupted in cheers and applause, seemingly in agreement with his proposition. Then, Jerry flopped onto his head on the seat and raised his legs in the air, seemingly energized by the throng. Agbar Bajabayamila, his other co-host, pleaded, No, 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 no. No, Jerry, Natalie Morales, on the other hand, made a simple gesture with her cue cards in his direction, appearing significantly less worried by his actions. She chuckled. I told you he'd go climbing on the furniture. We're not even five minutes into the show.